Hello and welcome to the next learning platform tutorials. In this video, we will see how students can attempt the different types of assessments using an Android or iOS device. In the previous video, you have already seen various types of assessments available in NLP. These include online, offline and hybrid assessments. In case you don't have a laptop or desktop computer, NLP allows you to attempt assessments using the NLP app on your mobile devices as well. If you're using an Android device, download the NLP app from the Google Play Store. Log in using your student credentials. Go to the exam corner. Here you will find two tabs, examination and practice. Under examination, you can find the ongoing examinations as well as past examinations. Click an examination card. Then click attempt. In case you are using an Apple device, download the app from the Apple App Store. Log in using your student credentials. Then click calendar. Here you can see all the upcoming assessments. Click any assessment to see its details. Click the resource to start attempting the assessment. For online assessment, you can answer all the questions on the mobile app itself. Click Begin Test. If it is a proctored assessment, the NLP app will ask you mobile permission to take pictures and record video and audio. Click the question mark at the bottom left corner of the screen. Here, you will see an option to chat with the proctor. You can also see a camera icon. Here, you will be able to see yourself. In case you violate any of the following proctoring rules, alerts will be raised and the same would be recorded in the proctoring reports as well. The prohibited activities include presence of multiple people in the camera frame, absence of the student in the camera frame, attempts to exit the app or toggle between the screens, attempts to disable the camera, external voices trying to assist the student with the assessment. Click on the arrow icon at the bottom right corner of the screen to see the panel with question numbers. You can easily switch between questions here. Once you have attempted all the questions, click End Test. If this is an online objective assessment, you will be able to view the reports immediately. If it is an online subjective assessment, the answers will be evaluated by your teacher. Now, let us see how you can attempt a subjective assessment on NLP. Click the assessment you would like to attempt. If it is a proctored assessment, the NLP app will ask mobile permission to take pictures and record video and audio. Place your device in such a manner that your face is clearly visible on the screen. Read the instructions carefully and then click Begin Test. The questions will be visible on your screen. You can write the answers on a paper and then click pictures of the same. These pictures have to be uploaded on the NLP before the exam timer runs out. Note that no extra time will be given for uploading the pictures. So, you have to start uploading answers at least 5 minutes before the timer ends. The allowed file formats for upload will be mentioned on the screen below the instructions. Click the upload button. On doing so, you will get two options, device storage and camera. If you already have clicked the pictures, upload them from device storage or else use the camera option to directly click the picture and upload. Once the timer reaches 5 minutes, it will start ticking, signaling that you are running out of time. Once the timer runs out, the assessment will be saved automatically and you will not be able to make any more changes. If you finish the upload before the timer runs out, you can click end test button to end the assessment. Now, let us see how you can attempt a hybrid assessment on the NLP app. As the name suggests, hybrid is a combination of both online and offline assessment. Here, students can attempt the objective questions online and then write the answers for the subjective questions offline. Just like in offline examinations, they can click pictures of the answers and then upload them to NLP before the timer runs out. In this video, we have seen how a student can attempt the three different modes of assessment through the NLP app. With its wide array of features, 
NLP aims to ensure a seamless teaching-learning experience for both students and teachers.